Total Warfare here. As you can see, the odds are grim. We are at 1500 men, led by our king, and we are defending a fort against 4,500. What happened here is we took the settlement, took some casualties, and then immediately we were besieged by a full stack from Gete, so we didn't get any replenishment. We took some under siege casualties. We then had to fight that full stack. We defeated it by, again, taking some casualties, and then we realized this guy is here with a full stack, fortified, ready to strike the next turn. So we had the choice of either staying inside running away or getting out and fortifying. So we decided to fortify because if he besieged us, if we stayed inside, we would have taken another two or three hundred men worth of under siege attrition and then it would be game over. So instead we decided to get out, get some fortifications out and force him to attack. Now that's what I thought would happen but what I did not expect is this guy having another stack here behind his main army and instead of three thousand versus one and a half we are now looking at four and a half versus one and a half so there's three times as many of them. Now our army is slightly better quality it's badly beaten up but we have a mixture of a uh, tier 1 and tier 2 units while they mainly have the basic stuff uh, club levies and spear levies plus a little bit of tier 1s and 2s uh, mixed in and mercenaries they do have two full strength generals though while our king's bodyguards are basically wiped out and we only have this guy coming to the rescue but we do have a couple of ballistas so that's fine unfortunately we also have a lot of uh, longbow hunters which are not that great against other barbarians because these fights are bloody and quick. Everyone has massive attack, weapon damage and javelins. No one has any armor. So it's really difficult to get a lot of value from units with a lot of ammunition. But we're stuck with them. I would gladly trade these five for maybe three more round shield swords. But we have what we have and we have to win this else the campaign is over. So let's jump right in. Okay, so we know they are just opposite to us, get everyone out. Now, we want ballistas to start firing as soon as they have a valid target, because these fights are real fast. So we want to maximize ammunition, just basically try to use as much of them as possible. And let's put our best defensive guy here. This guy only took 24 uh, casualties. He's got 82 melee defenses, 53 armor. So hopefully he will hold just for a little bit. Second best in shape guy comes here and the third one here in case they want to flank us. Now these two beaten up guys, I'm going to put them here so they can throw their javelins into their unshielded sides. And I'm going to do the same with uh, one swordsman and these Germanic youths. And also I think we can squeeze one archer here by the looks of it. Yeah, like this. Okay, that leaves us two more swords. Let's put them, one of them here and the other one here. All right, we want to use javelins if possible before we throw these guys into melee. And let's put this archer over here. And those three, I want to use to flank them because we'll get much better results getting over here and shooting them in the backs and unshielded sides rather than shooting from over here into their shields. General is down to 17 bodyguards, so it's not very useful. Just keep him inside. And these swords are almost uh, dead too, so just, I don't know, stick them here. Now we also have some deployables. More than usual, because I was uh, about to test this army tradition that gives more barricades and uh, melee defense and armor. So these don't matter anyway, just stick them wherever, it's uh, it's not important. But since we already have them, might as well use them. Okay, just to slow them down a little bit. Going to throw all of them here, because this is where their first army will be coming from. And let's do it. Yeah, so they are here as expected. Speed this up. Enemy yeah, General is hammering ahead. Oh, our guy is over here. Come. And they are over here. Okay. We are losing ground. Yeah, we're losing ground because there's three times as many of them. No wonder. Okay, we got a couple of ballista shots on this guy. He's down to 40 men already. Excellent. Now, switch to the infantry. We are not worried about his general. He's only cavalry he's gonna get stuck on these like spikes and then get the round of javelins from all of these guys and that'll be the end of him right slow this down these guys are now in range we should be shooting the biggest blob we can find which is here instead of uh, these guys they are too spread out they are in range of him too so you aim at him The enemy general is dead, excellent. This is what happens if you rush your general into impossible combat. That's what I like to see. So they all suffered morale penalty now. It's very good. You guys come here. Yeah, the first ones are getting to the barricade. 
They are getting smashed by all the javelins, so that's good. Ballistas, how are you doing? 80 and 200 kills. Not too bad, not too bad. Maybe let's diversify a little bit and you start shooting this. You guys shooting yet? Not yet. Okay, get into position then. How are you doing? Only two kills. You already lost like 11 men. Hope you do better. Combat even, huh? At least you have a lot of guys around you, right? It looks like all of them are channeling towards the main entrance. At least this is how it looks to me. So you can start flanking them. You come here. Guys, you're shooting? You're shooting. Excellent. 9, 50 and 17. Not too bad. And the other bowman? The Germanic Qs got 40 kills each. That's not too bad. But these guys got barely any kills. Yeah, that's why you want to flank them and uh, be shooting from here. Right, no one's even chasing our archers. Weird. Okay, we really want to destroy the slingers. So, you come here. Alright, they are chasing after us. You pull back. What is this? Club levy and spear levy. Okay, you come out. You'll stop them. Ah, uh, it's like four units, okay. You need to stay out of there. Okay, you come here, you let them chase you. You come here, right, I think we need to start throwing these guys into the mix, because this guy is down to 80 men, so everyone just jump in. Okay, you shoot them, you shoot them, you charge at these guys, you charge at these guys. Yeah, he's shooting their unshielded side, which is great. Come a little bit closer. Point blank damage is even higher. And our king got these three guys. Perfect. Ballistas, what are you doing? You should be shooting the guy that's farthest away to avoid any friendly fire, if possible. Okay, this guy's already wavering. Perfect. Uh, I don't think he's under attack. He's the one wrecking havoc here. He's not lost a single man, killed 30 already. He's doing really well. Okay, the line is kinda holding. It's looking good. This guy has enough, he's down to 40. This is down to 90. Yeah, both are wavering. Okay, you can start moving here. They won't last for long anyway. Yep, yeah, one is gone. The other one is gone too. Okay, perfect. Guys, move here. You move here. How are we doing against these guys? 100 left. 70 left. We've not lost a single bodyguard. Excellent. Ballistas, how are you doing? 300 kills, 400 kills. Looking good, looking good. Okay, our guys over here are losing decisively. The walls are breached. The walls are breached, yeah, because we are hammering them with Ballista. Okay, throw this guy in. And him. Yeah, his shooters are wavering. Excellent. We can then throw the cavalry into the mix. You attack this, you guys spread out here and start shooting them. Okay, this archer is out of ammo, killed 150, that's not too bad, not too bad. How about the javelin man? 50 and 70, that's not great, we would have been better off just using them to flank as well. Alright, they start to waver, that's good, that's very good. Right, you come back here, you'll do the rear charge that will hopefully end the battle. Yeah, the walls are breached because of Ballista. Of course they are breached. Right, cavalry, get in here. And Ballistas, you guys done enough. Stop. You attack. We don't even need this cavalry charge. Looks like the whole thing is collapsing. Yeah, it's over. Excellent. Gonna wipe them out. Heroic victory, there we go. Alright, so you wiped out the small stack. And the uh, big stack only got away with 60 slingers. That's not too bad for 300 men lost. Yeah, look at this ballista kill count. 600. 300 on this one. 500 on this uh, cavalry. Yeah, pretty good. That's how we do it. Destination reached.